Welcome to 3 at 5, three of the top trending news stories at 5 p.m. every day. I'm Andrea Dan. Mainland China's toughest food safety law will be enforced on October the 1st. With the new law, the most serious food safety offenders will not only be sentenced to imprisonment, but also never be allowed to do business in the food industry ever again. The new law raises the highest fines against using meat of dead animals from 10 times the value of the problematic food to now 30 times. Other clauses are also added, targeting abuse of antibiotics, pesticides, and other chemicals that will do great harm to people's health. Paragray, an 11-year-old girl who was denied an abortion last year, gave birth to a baby girl. She was pregnant after being raped by her 42-year-old stepfather, who is now pending trial for rape. The baby was delivered by C-section as a natural birth which judged to be too dangerous for her. Both the 11-year-old girl and her baby are healthy. Last year, Paraguay's health minister refused the request from the girl's mother to terminate the pregnancy, sparking controversy. In Paraguay, abortion is only allowed when the mother's life is endangered. In all other cases, the procedure is a crime. In Hong Kong, Kindergarten Association President Mary Tong Siu Fan called for the government to ease procedures of application of building new kindergartens. She said while there are enough kindergartens in Hong Kong, some of the districts have too much of them, while others don't have enough. But when new kindergartens file application for construction, it always takes more than a year to get approval from eight governmental departments. And that time is way too long. That's it for today. For more of these news stories and much more, visit ChinaDailyAsia.com.